Chris Santo, he'll knock it back to Terry Waldorf. Waldorf stolen away by Bolela in the neutral zone. They've got numbers up. Left-footed shot. It goes in. Mariano Bolela unassisted. And that gets the score tied. And again, defense turns into offense as he just stole that one away. In the neutral zone, dribbled in, took the shot from about the red line and put it home. Bolela winds up on it, taps it out to Moreno. He'll wind up, big shot blocked by Beto. He gets down to Castillo. Shot star! Alejandro Moreno from Murcho Castillo. And the Twisters do get the shot. They get a couple of them, and the last one goes in. Exactly what they want him to do. You know, Bolela, instead of taking the shot up the, up the direct, direct kick there, passes it to Moreno. They get a shot off, they get a rebound, and Reno gets the ball back, boom, back in the net. And that's the kind of thing in indoor where the, bo the ball is just kind of moving so quick, the defense is out of, out of alignment, and they're out of, you know, they're a little bit disorganized, and took, a, took advantage of that one there. So here they go, they go up uh, a goal, exactly what they wanted to have happen. Time winding down in the power play, 40 seconds left. Bolela inside the red line, off to Moreno, he'll wind up, big shot, he scores! Moreno just drilled that one home from 35 feet out. Waldorf tried to go down, but it went off his left hand and in, and it's 3-1 Indiana. We see it so often, just outside, just outside the arc. Players taking one, one touch shot. Banks plays it up ahead to Beto. Beto, shot kick saved by Kluba, as he dropped down and got a foot on it. Callahan and Olavi battle for it at the red line. Comes down and Blakeman taps it up ahead to Moreno. Alejandro has a pair of goals tonight. And across the red line. Moreno across the Blakeman. Shot score! Sean Blakeman puts the Twisters up 4-3 against his former team as Moreno left footed across into the area and Blakeman just drilled it for his first goal as a Twister. What an outstanding goal. Moreno created the entire play. Actually, Blakeman created the play back in the defensive zone by intercepting the pass. Put the ball to the far board to Moreno. Moreno just hightailed it into the offensive zone of Houston. Drove it across the face of the goal and just inside the circle. Inside the arc and Blakeman just one touch it with the right foot. Back at MSA, the sixth attacker is on. It is Zian Allen for Houston. They haven't had much success or much time with the sixth attacker on. Loose ball in front. It goes into the goal. I believe Alejandro Moreno is going to get credit for his third of the night. So just 18 seconds after coming on as the sixth attacker, Zian Allen gives up a goal, and that one actually just scooted along the boards and just followed that trail all the way in. One minute to go. Twister's up 5-3. Looks like they're going to beat the hot shot. And now wide open net at the other end. Here comes Mirko Castillo. Zian Allen gets back. It's two on one. Castillo with a shot. He scores! Mirko Castillo waits till almost the last minute to extend his goal-scoring streak to seven games. He gets one against his former mates and climbs the glass on the far side. That makes it 6-3, and that'll just about do it. Situation there where Houston has no choice. They have to push everybody forward and attack. They left themselves completely vulnerable in the back. Indiana made a quick counterattack. Great transition. Castillo just sprints with the ball into the zone and just drove it home. Absolutely no chance for Houston. So the streak by Mirko, now seven games, extends his own club record, and Rohano gets the assist to extend his point scoring streak to eight games. The Twisters beat the hot shot by a final score of 6-3 here at Market Square Arena tonight. And Houston looks stunned.